see the umpires making their way out to the ground. The forecast is good. Below them, as one of the teams that have yet to register a win, only playing the one game, of course. All right, first ball about to get underway here. It's been bowled by Rizwan. He's coming in from the school end, and it's short and wideish, but not ruled wide. High back lift, and goes to Tonkum over mid wicket. Tonks pretty well. It's going to be a boundary, first boundary here. Four runs. This time, eases and cuts in front of point. Cuts well. Riaz again. This time, foolish honing in on middle stump. It's been again. As well as the mid off. The offside got him, bold, middle stump, maybe middle and off, and the bowler. And yeah, middle, middle stump. Hones in on leg stump, off the pad. They scamper through, this will be a run out. This is the second wicket here, and a mix up. What went wrong? Here's the replay. Non-striker calling his partner through who didn't move an inch. And, well, with ball in hand at the moment. Got him. He's gone. Well, the pressure building, I guess, for the Titans. And you can understand Chandrai just wanting a release shot. Just getting a bit of movement. Pace wasn't the problem. He just played all around it. Good job of... Oh, a big appeal. And, uh, gee, perhaps just missing leg for the Tokyo Titans Club. Goes to swipe. And will be caught. Dropped. Dropped it out to deep mid-wicket. Coming in from the school end. Sorry, the mountain end. Chance for the first ball, falls safely and won't result in a boundary. Perhaps a little bit of flack from his teammates, Not new, but perhaps be a bit more aggressive. Driven through the covers and that has been driven beautifully. We continue, it's been skied and square leg is dropped it and Yet perhaps another example. Almost a run out though. Oh, chance of an overthrow? No, not taken. It's definitely gone up a gear. This time over covers. He's hit it well. And well enough for four. This is... Smacked. Over mid wicket's head. Yes. And it was that. Priya Dasha. For a moment there, I thought deep mid wicket. Looks to go straight, edges it out, and in the end, boundary is the result. Four runs. Let's see what happens if this one comes down the wicket, squeezes it out, square leg. He's been turned down, an appeal, and another collision. In terms of the players, and he is short, has gone. Oh, I thought he had made it. I can see his disappointment. The curly well, really, in the end, there was always... There was a run there, but his partner... Cut ...looking to hit, which is good to see, and this time it's Priyadasha. Will he go? No, it doesn't make it a key wicket. The replay here. He's just lifted it. Perhaps got a little bit too high there in terms of projection. Safely caught. It's plenty of bounce. This one's been swept. Swept for four runs. 130, but well. Starts. Just falls out of reach of deep mid wicket. Valiant effort that is uh, respected to get that strike rate up around 150. This time, that sounded good, and there we go, four runs. Can they continue the good start of this over? 
This time skying it. And no, making it six runs. Another big shot. Contribution he's already made 18 off eight. Can he keep going? Really giving a boost here to the Titans. Can it be a dream over? He comes down the wicket, punishes it. Punishes it for six. The medicine needed. Look at the JCA replay. Using his feet to create some momentum, but then having a solid base, hitting through of the arms. Nice follow through. Got him. Gone. Top of middle. Riaz wins the battle. Well, he deserves it. He's bowled really well as Riaz. That's his second. And the end of his four overs. Final over. And he's given himself room. Scooped him out onto the onside. For four runs. Great shot. Comes down the wicket. Inside edge. That might be the perfect shot in this situation. It's four runs. There's no fielder down there. Good over thus far. Starts running already. The non-strike. He skies it. They'll run one. They'll look to run two unless it's been caught. It is dropped. No surprises there. That's the third. And a run out to complete it. But you can understand the batsman just pushing as hard as possible. We'll have to just to judge the scorers. It's a summary of the, the scorecard. And really, it's that middle order. Find our first ball here comes in Sajid, and it's a wide one to start. Chance gone, given. Just played. No, not, not given. Boy, the way they celebrated. Falls over, and his delivery stride, and has been swatted. For a lovely shot and four runs. This time, again, he just it has a firm base, but he just clobbers it. And for a maximum two, just landing over the, through the ball. Just steps, turns the his foot to be more straighter as he, early on in the piece. This time, it's just been sort of turned lazily onto the onside turned well enough though for four runs as both field as well i guess this one's just dabbed at through to the keeper who appeals as does first slip and given yep awards this one going across the batsman and safely taken to shot Driven beautifully through the covers. Four runs. They won't stop that. The back of him. And wow, he just helps this one on its way. That'll run away. Races for, across the line for four. And helped on its way. Another boundary four. Carted out over square leg for another boundary forward, just as I said, he's and perhaps keep his partner on strike as he lodges another boundary four this time and cuts, cuts behind point. And what a beautiful shot! Taken. Niazi goes to punish one over mid wicket. Knew straight away he hadn't really got enough of it, and in the end, comfortably taken. Loaded one up there, and again, he's almost, he's been, Sapan's come down the wicket, driven it, and driven it all the way for six for a moment there. Full maximum for Spin. Comes down the wicket. Uses just muscles it over the boundary rope. So Tundraya continues, and this time down on one leg, it is a slog sweep for six runs. Lovely shot. 
goes down his back leg on the ground, but just a lovely sweep shot. Sapun looking to give himself room on the onside, steps out to the offside and just clears square leg of anguish. This time it's hit straight, and this time it's a lot more clear. It is four runs, his second over. Stray's down leg and helped on its way. This will go for the maximum, will it? It's good enough to catch up. Pull, hook shot. Well, I didn't really get high enough for a hook, but uh, 22 away, uh, the Max Cricket Club. Interesting shot. Well executed for four runs. Haven't really needed to if the number of boundaries they've hit. <sighs> Down. Second game for both teams. For defence that, well, it's pushed past the bowler and uh, bowler probably didn't feel he could go for the ball because it was under the feet almost of the non-striker. 50 runs anyway for Sipun. Well done. Congratulations to him on yet another milestone. His 50 runs coming off 42 balls at a strike rate of 119. Wow, it's been mass massacred out to mid-wicket. More fireworks. Boundary four, this time over cover. A lovely balanced shot. And it'll go for four. The fielder perhaps looking to uh, take that on the full, if not the half volley, it beats him. And not only does it beat him, the opposition beats their team. Max winners today. 43 for Niazi, 54 for Navaratna, 34 for Rashid. The three of them, another match this afternoon in 58 minutes time.